What's up guys? Today is day one here in Costa Rica. Me and Carol arrived last night pretty late, so today's the first day I'm going to be filming. We just woke up. We, we woke up really early, like around 5.30, because that's when sunrise is around here. We're in a really nice hotel that we stayed last night. I'll show you around. It's got like a really traditional look to it, all wooden. Got these cool masks as well. So this hotel is just like on the outskirts of the capital, San Jose, and it's actually pretty cheap. We got it for $22. It was supposed to be $44, but I think we got like a half price deal on Expedia, so yeah, way worth it. I'm going to show you outside as well because it looks really nice out there. You can see it looks really nice, the colors. Down here you got the pool. Super green. So yeah, it's a bit dark at the moment since um, since it's so early, the sun hasn't come out. But this place is really nice. I hope this this is a sign of how it's gonna look, Costa Rica, all green. It's one of the reasons we came here. All right, let's head back in. <laughs> so the main reason we got up so early is because we're actually going to be going to a, a volcano right now. And they said you gotta get there pretty early for the so that the clouds don't form. The weather's gonna be a bit weird during the whole stay here probably from, from the forecast, so I don't know, we might even get to the volcano and it's all overcast and I can't see anything, but yeah, we'll find out. And then after that, we should be checking out some waterfalls and stuff, so yeah, it should be a pretty cool day. Alright, so after like a two hour drive up the mountains, we're finally here at a place called Volcano Irazu. I forgot to introduce Carol, she's here on this trip. Hi. What's up? <laughs> so, it is actually like really cloudy at the moment, we're basically in a cloud, so I don't know how much we're gonna see. <laughs> So here it is, 300 meters deep, we got lucky. super lucky because it was basically just clouds all the way around but and the only opening that we could see was just the little crater with the uh, awesome like little kind of like a little lake I guess so this volcano is 11,000 feet high and it's the highest active volcano in Costa Rica and I think the last time it erupted was in like 1995 so yeah it's just really cool my first ever volcano you look around now completely in the clouds <laughs> I think it's messing up my camera. first ever volcano? Yes. Really? Yeah. Do they have volcanoes in Brazil? They do, but they're not active. Oh, no. Yeah, so this was also my first time going to a volcano, so pretty cool experience. Now it's just completely overcast, like, yeah, we're just literally in one huge cloud now. Can't really see anything all the way around. Kids going crazy. 
So yeah, we're probably gonna head out soon. It's like really freezing. My my hands are like becoming frozen. And then um, yeah, I don't know what we're gonna do next. Probably grab a bite to eat and check out some waterfalls. We've now come to a place called La Pais Waterfall Gardens. It was actually really expensive, it's $44 per person, but we drove all the way here, so yeah, we kind of felt we had to do it. It's supposed to be, like, like I said before, loads of cool waterfalls, wildlife and stuff. It's been raining, so I don't know if all the wildlife's about, but yeah, it looks really cool at the moment. See the clouds at the top of the rainforest? So yeah, proper like rainforest feeling here. Properly, but this is the upper viewpoint of the waterfall so this is like one of four or five that we're going to be going to but yeah that looks pretty sick Okay, so this is definitely the best viewpoint. I'm literally like right beneath the waterfall right now. Even though it's like raining and stuff, I, I had to take off my hoodie because it's so like humid here. It's getting really hot and sweaty. And I think we're heading out now. We've seen pretty much all the waterfalls. Like, I don't know how many, how many of them I will have shown you guys, but there's like five separate awesome waterfalls. Like, really good. I haven't seen that many waterfalls in my, in my life, so to see so many together, pretty awesome. Yeah, maybe it was worth the $44 because it's just a really good moment and we're going to be heading out. We just arrived here in a place called La Fortuna, which is about three and a half hours north from where we started today. Just got ourselves a new place to stay, which is over here. Pretty basic, like $30, but we just want a bed basically. We're out all day anyway, so we don't usually care where we're staying. And we came here because tomorrow we're going to spend the day in La Fortuna. There's supposed to be more like awesome waterfalls and cool like jungles to hike in again. So pretty similar to what we did today, but that's exactly the reason I came here. So it should be good. So as always, if you like the video, please leave that like, comment, and I'll get back to you. And subscribe if you want to see more videos like this. And I'll see you in the next one.